Right. On behalf of the staff of the Independent California Motel, I wish you all sweet dreams. Johnny the fucking bad. Last, Last night, when, when we were talking, we were talking to, Saul. to Saul, thanks for, thanks for standing up for me. Though, Though one, thing, one thing, the race, the race, the race, the race the it's the start, the start of something we need to repent. night we don't need to talk about that i'm just not like that so what are you like more like this holy welcome holy cuz take, take care of yourself you too you too man and remember, and remember i'm indebted Circumstances were different. I'd say saddle up and ride after her. But here and now, just look. Damn hard to catch a girl like that. Only hope you've got is they feel a pang and stop to wait. What's with you? Don't know, a memory, maybe. Don't matter. Okay, back to town, V. Headed up to here with this gusty out... Forget for a second that this is not mine. 
And also, no, I didn't forget, actually. I just don't fucking like it at all. Because of the visor. I don't know what it is about those visors, man, but I fucking hate them.
Ui, oh that's a picture of him! actually Thank <laughs> you. 
thinking, thinking about, about getting some new chrome. But I think you're going to be like place. place. I'm thinking I'm getting some bitches. Wrong place. Wrong fucking place. Get the fuck out of my sight. Yeah, that's, that's on me. My bad. Does anything change? Holy shit, bruh. Just the armor. Did that point shit is swift, bro. Like, God damn. Come here. Mantis. Switch them out back to normal. Why not? The normal ones are better. My opinion. My body, my choice. <laughs> Oh, 
I want the damage to go down that low, you know? Like, dude, holy shit. See the fall of the damage on that one. Say shit was up on it. Oh shit. That would jump the right one. Thank <sighs> you. 
area. Criminal activity confirmed in Santo Domingo. I repeat, confirmed criminal activity in Santo Domingo. 521 reporting. Sorry, dispatch. Had to take a leak. I'm on route. Last seen driving a vehicle, transporting 
Hey, Claire. Next race. You ready? It'll be a tough one. Off-road, lots of lead flying. We'll take Beast. I want to try her out in the field. Nova. FYI, I'm already here. Perfect. Join you in a sec. Sounds good. See ya. I really thought you'd stand me up again. I thought Bully would have to ride shotgun. Bully is a fantastic shot. He is, he is. But he's talking, always. Too much. His mouth never stops running. It's hey, distracting. V. I Good take to see the turns too wide. Got another race to so run, So next huh? time I actually don't uh, make second it, of four, I hope. there's duct tape in the Ready trunk. Ready to go off-road? Just saying. You forget something? Okay, I'm back. Talk. You feeling all right? Second of four, I hope. Ready to go off road? Think this one will be tough? Mm -hmm. Badlands, so no fucking around. Anything goes in this. Hey guys, remember? No, 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 I don't have it. Maximum madness. Well, how am I supposed to know who's got it? Dude, this is your problem, not mine. Ladies and gentlemen, get your pants. Hey, you! Ignore him. Luigi tries to get in people's heads. Yeah? What's up? Just wanted to wish you luck! Th Three! Two!
them to the finish line. Why, no way the missus will believe I bet on the winning horse. But I gave you an easy task. Ah, of course, you let him. I do not give a shit. Your last driver is better than I am? He was a good husband. An amazing wheel. Hey, what gives? As you were saying. You ready to talk? A good husband. An amazing wheelman. How'd he die, if you don't mind me asking? How do any competitive racers die? We reached the final last year. We were strong. Out in front when. Maybe we should change the subject. Yeah. You want to lift to my garage? Sure, thanks. Let's go. This is my first time using Flash Travel.
What the fuck? Crystal Palace. To the casinos, five poles, top end brain dance equipment, and the best chefs in the universe. If you're looking for a taste of paradise, <laughs> you're going to be the Crystal Palace. The Crystal Palace for $7299 right now. We're gonna get, get shit. Talking about V, hey, do you have a moment? Need to talk? I mean a longer moment. Can you come by the camp? I have a problem. On my way. Phew. Thanks. That's good to hear. Give me a little more intel. What's your grief? Well, it uh, would be better. Let to... me guess. Saul, right? You know me well. Uh-huh. See you soon. Stay here in camp. V, you're here. What is he doing here? I forbade you from even breathing on that Militech convoy, so you call in your friend? To do it all behind my back? Is that it? Uh-huh. That's exactly why I had V come and stand right in front of you. Got v no fucking clue what's... But a chance like this! Get the sense... The Biotechnica people will be here in an... What's this Basilisk nonsense? It's an armored Militech cargo panzer. Junk from back in 2060 or so. They want to pedal it off to a backwards country, somewhere it can still pass as a technological wonder. The Militech convoy will take the one. Is this basilisk worth another fight with Saul? Yes, a craft like that would finally put us back on the right path. Cassidy, Ted, Carol, and Bob also on board. And you plan to grab the Basilisk how? Thanks, V. Haven't said I'd help just yet. Okay, let's go talk to the rest. So, just the four vets on board with the plan. Nobody else? We didn't bother asking the others. There was too great a risk someone would take it to Saul. Besides, only the vets understand what we have to gain by having a basilisk. Sounds pretty risky to me. On the contrary, easy as pie. There won't even be much security on the convoy. Plus, we'll be doing our part towards furthering the cause of world peace. Why should this beast wind up being used in some little third world skirmish? We'll make better use of it right here in America. Did you try to get Saul on board again? No luck, huh? No. Okay, everyone listen. Militech will transport the Basilisk in parts distributed across two trucks. Wait, do I sense a quiver in your voice? Fuck you! The convoy will halt at the railroad crossing on the 101. We'll attack from behind, then get the hell out and away. Questions? Comments? Motions? Nice job, Sunshine. Mm-hmm. Okay, I'm in. Hmm, okay. Thanks. 
First, we'll ride to the station. The train engine we need to block the convoy's way is there. Are you riding with us, or will we meet you there? Riding with you. Excellent. Let's get going. I think I heard a little shake in that voice. You did not. Ah, uh, come on. Did you get your hands clammy, too? Screw you. But are you sure you didn't leave any tracks? Militech won't notice a thing. Are you trying to insult me, Bobby? Okay, okay. Forget I even asked. Let's go. We have arrived. Big bastard. If you like it so much, maybe we should just hijack the train. Let the basilisk go on its way. Yeah, then just drive this beast to the 101. There and back. Saul would be on board with that. Are we ready? Okay. The Militech convoy will be traveling from Night City to the base where they're due to meet the buyer. We will stop it at the railroad crossing. All we have to do is shove this beauty in its way. V, any questions? Plan to move this thing how exactly? It's old tech. Carol will have to hack it. Then I'll somehow have to finagle authorization from the control tower to move it. Tower looks inactive to me, too. Yeah, we'll see to that. You and Pan Am just get the authorization code. Okay, let's get to work. Stairs it is, then. Do you need a light? Well done. Thanks, boys. I've always been fond of trains. And the stations where so many tracks converge. <laughs> Junctions. Yes, those. When you see them from above, you feel... Free. Like you could set off in a thousand journeys all at once. Perhaps more simply, hopeful. Okay, here we are. Carol! What are we looking for? Ox cards! What cards? Would you help me look? Sure thing. Nothing here. Nada. Nada. Nothing here. Nada. Nothing here. Hmm. <laughs> well, well, well.
Got something. Good job. Carol! We have a card! What now? <clears throat> you have to put it in the reader! <sighs> Here goes nothing. It worked! Come look! Little engine that could. V, I wanted to speak with you. What did you want to talk about? I know this may sound foolish, because I asked you to help me, but... Why are you doing this? Because it's important to you. But is that all? I... Sorry, that sounded worse than I intended. Listen, V, I... I'm sorry. I'm not very good at this. Speaking of my feelings and so forth. And I would not want to cut this up. Well, that's a start. The thing is, I usually act before I think. Uh-huh. Noticed. I know. But I also need impulses to act upon. When I do something spontaneously, I feel I'm being honest. Yet with you, I prefer to play it safe. Why is it any different with me? Because I truly care this time. Yet I fear I'll do or say something foolish and be left alone in the desert. I would rather keep you close, if only as a friend. Try following the impulse next time. Okay. Well, in any case, you've been warned. All right, let's rejoin the others. Bye.